Hello everybody, this is Angel Arts, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Persona 5. It's Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Doesn't that mean that there's a... We're only halfway through the election season, but it seems the victor is already clear. I thought there was normally like a shopping network special on Sundays. Isn't that true? The United Future, led by Mr. Shido, has been dominating the other parties. Victory seems certain for them, and people have high hopes about giving a new prime, having a new prime minister. As for Mr. Shido himself, he was once again out giving speeches and, at this rate, he's going to be the next prime minister. We have to make him have a change of heart. Yeah, I'm working on it. <gasps> yeah, EY. I got a job for you gathering info. You'll be solo on this one. I'm tied up with another task. I feel like I can become closer with EY thanks to the hanged man persona Huapo. Yes, yes, EY, love me. Love me, my sexy uncle. Head over immediately. Okay, here's today's job. There's a homeless guy in Shibuya who knows about a certain issue. Get him to talk about the rumor of a deal in the underworld. But don't raise any suspicions, all right? Okay, I won't ask too many questions. So you want to know about some underground business deals, huh? You know you can find anything you need in the internet, right? Or you, are, you may be looking for something a little more... A little more. I can see it in your eyes. Who sent you here? Um, it's none of your business. EY. Um, I can't tell you. Sticking to the code of honor, huh? Not bad for a kid. Alright, just act like I'm mumbling to myself. You got it? No promises. I'm, I'm gonna say anything useful either. So, an exec for the Hong Kong Mafia came to Japan sometime around New Year's of this year. Apparently, something big went down with a huge Asian investor. Deal was worth about 100 million yen. Though you'd figure something that massive would have got more people talking about it. Maybe they leased some kind of high-end club to keep it as private as possible. I didn't hear a thing about that, though. Alright, we're done here. Go. Okay, I guess I'm gonna report back. Your store is impressive as always. Great stuff, EY. Yeah. It's nice to hear that coming from you, Suda-san. I bet you could start a war with these realistic models like these. Seriously, these are incredible. I should get going now, though. Hmm? Yo. Welcome. All right, EY. I'll take one of everything you showed me today. I'll need an entire arsenal. How long would that take? <sighs> Depends on how quick the parts come in. Some stuff's probably gonna have to go through customs. How long things get stuck there is totally out of my control, though. Tell me, Moon, Mooney, what's your son's name? Karokukun, was it? That's right. Well then, if you don't deliver on time, I might just have to let Karokun and you in on your little secret. <clears throat> Suda-san, please. I wonder how will an adolescent boy like him react to finding out his father was in the Yakuza? I guess if things go sour, we could always try to sell him again. Fine, I'll take. I'll put a rush on your order. Happy now? Very much so. Well then, I look forward to hearing from you again. Soon. Sorry to make you wait, kid. Oh, what was that all about? Shit. Um... What was that about? What did he mean, sell him? <sighs> Just forget about it. Sorry you had to see that. Anyways, how'd it go today? You learned about anything good? Um, the Hong Kong Mafia, 100 million yen deal. Um, I mean, what's more important to tell him? Can't I just tell him both? Uh, the Hong Kong Mafia. Huh, so someone made a big deal with the Hong Kong Mafia worth 100 million yen. Apparently I did tell them both, and it happened sometime around New Year's. Wouldn't be surprised, it wouldn't surprise me if Suda had something to do with it. I hear he's been bragging all over about the, about a big score he made right near the start of the year. I've got to do some more research into it myself. <laughs> Anyways, nice job. I'm going to be able to give Suda a real scare thanks to the info you gave me. Um, you two should play nice. Where's my reward? Give it your all. Heh, <laughs> that goes without saying. <laughs> Man, I can't wait to see the look on Suda's face. It's been ages since I felt this excited. And it's all cause of you, kid. Turns out you're pretty useful. Aw, shucks. It feels like my bond with EY is growing even deeper. Yeah! Ranked up. 
All right. Dang, man, count on its feast four. Well, I'm gonna head home early and spend some good old quality time with Koru Yo. to celebrate. Fine job again, kid. Get out. Now get out of here. I feel like helping EY with his work has honed my proficiency, even though I am maxed to everything. I am maxed. All right. Later. Nice. I'll see you next time. Thanks. Daddy O, Uncle Leo. Do 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 We're going through the days. Akechi Kun is so impressive. I can't believe he's still in high school. Did you watch that TV special about the heroes who took down the Phantom Thieves? I saw it too. It did make me like Akechi Kun more, but honestly, now I'm really big fan of Shido san. If, if he was my boss, I'd follow him no matter where he went. <clears throat> These people can't see past their own fat noses. They're crazier about Shido than ever before. When I think about how he used us, it pees me right the heck off. Well, it'll be fine. The better his reputation gets, the more I look forward to tearing it all down. We'll make him own up to all this BS. Then they'll see who the real heroes are. Do 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 After school again. Hey. There's only 13 days left. You sure you got time to relax? Oh yeah, lucky 13. Let's go. Shinjuku, red light district. I need to continue beefing up my relations with people. You are so useful, um, Chahaya. So glad I leveled you up. What shall we do? Let's do an affinity reading. On Hifumi. Where is Hifumi? Chihaya. Ifumi Togo. Yeah, the star. This reading will cost you 5,000 yen. Have it read, I said. Here we go. Here I go. Hmm. Your feelings should have reached the other person. I bet you can deepen your friendship even further now. Well, that's all for today. What do you think? If you're happy with your fortune, look forward to your next visit. Perfect. Yusuke can't level up. Haru I can level up. That's a good one. Let's let's also um see how much what we've got in the clinic. Let's check out the clinic. Because we've got new things to buy. An election at a time like this? Blah, I'm too lazy to vote. Well, I guess that doesn't concern you yet. What do you want? I want to buy something. Please head to the exam. Let's head to the examination room. All right, let's see all, all the new stuff. Okay. Which one? Magic ointment forms a barrier on one ally that reflects magic except Almighty once. Why do you have such physical a ointment forms a barrier on an ally that reflects physical attacks once. Wow, I have six of these. Two of these. Homunculus protects from insta-kill attacks once. Oh my, 60,000? 60,000? Revive all. New drug developed by TMC. Revives all fallen allies with 50 HP. Renew all. New drug developed by TMC. Revives all fallen allies with full... Oh my goodness. These are expensive. My goodness. I see. And, all right. Well, buy items. I mean, I need better vibes, so... Goodness gravy! Take your time. I mean... Monculus. Protects from insta-kill attacks once. New drug developed by TMC. All fall it with 50 HP. I mean, these are really expensive. I'm gonna... I guess I'm gonna wait. I just know... I'm, I'll, I'll think about it. Take care. I know it's there. Did it work? Did all that work leveling her up for things that I might not want to buy right away? <laughs> That's okay. We'll go to the underground walkway. Hi. Oh, Angelus, there you are. I finished your desired duplication. Thank you. All right. Let's go to Haru. What are you going to do now? Let's head to the rooftop. 
Alright, let's sneak past everyone and go up to the emergency exit. Let's... let's do it. Good day. What do you want to do today, Angelus Kun? I want to see the vegetables. <laughs> that makes me happy. These ones have done enough growing. We can harvest them now. Nice. Thanks to leveling you up, I can do it. They've grown so well. They're all so healthy, and treat them with care and respect, okay? Alright. Good day. What do you want to do today, Angelus Gun? Let's hang out. Huh? At a time like this. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. We have some time to talk today. My bond will grow stronger soon. Hang out with her. Yes. Okay, thank you. You see. Hey! Hey, Angelus Kun, do you remember the magic item I mentioned before? Yeah. The thing that will help me show Takura-san how I really feel is right here. Uh, that beetle over there? Huh? Huh? Oh wow, that one is huge, but that's not exactly it. You see, the soil here is special mix I made with a new few different kinds of fertilizer. It's a very high quality. It's soft, it's warm, it has good drainage, and it's full of nutrients. This, this is the magic I need. Oh, okay. I'm not very good at expressing myself with words. I, I, just thinking about it makes my heart race. But I've been pouring my heart and soul into the soil for months now. It knows exactly how I feel. Um. That's why I'm going to use it to grow my coffee plants. Then once they're ready, I'm going to make coffee with the beans. It shouldn't be much longer now. Honestly, just raising those plants has taken considerate effort. I've checked on them every day, given them water, put them in the sun. But all of that love and care has found its way into the beans themselves. Combining that with the nurturing warmth of the soil should give me the perfect way to convey how I feel. I wonder what Takahura-san will think when he tries it. Um... It'll help him understand you. Yes! Yeah, I fully believe in that. It's strange. Only recently I was struggling to find belief in anything. By the way, I thought about it some more, and I wouldn't necessarily be opposed to Takahura-san's idea. If that's what management decides to do, I won't get in their way. At the same time, I can't support them if their main goal is to deceive. What I mean is, people don't think of Okumar foods very highly right now. So I'm afraid management is trying to use this new chain to sneak under the radar, rather than rebuild our image. Of course, I understand how hard it is to rid yourself of a negative label. But, but if they want to fool people with low-quality product instead of regaining their trust, I will proudly oppose them. Um, you're amazing, Haru. <laughs> Well, naturally, I'm a hero and of justice after all. Just kidding. You know, Angelus Kun, it's so reassuring having you here. It's because of you that I was able to cultivate this soil. And because of that, I have the courage to tell Takokoro san how I feel. Um. Speaking of which, um, do you think you could be there with when I do it? As long as you're with me, I won't be afraid to say what I'm thinking. I can sense an earnest resolve from Haru. Endure. Tends to withstand an otherwise fatal attack with one hit point right. remaining. Nice. Now then, I need to take some of the soil home to my coffee plants. Could you carry a bag for me? Sure. Goodbye. Well, see you later. You're very welcome. I forgot to get plants done. Oh, well. I was gonna have plants grow. Forgot to do that. Game. Can I still do that after school? What's the point of coming to school this late at night? It'd be annoying if we can get caught by the teachers. Let's disperse. Why even give me the option if I can't... Why even give me the option? Game, come on. I don't want to do anything with Oya. I can level up... <gasps> Hifumi is ready! Yes! Yes, Ifumi. That was why was that e so much easier than Takemi? Crazy easier than Takemi. Crazy easier. Good evening. Amazion knows no standard moves. There are no set principles for victory. You must always seek to make the best move possible. Please continue to do what you believe is right. From a teacher to her student, there's something I'd like to ask you. Will you play a match with me? I feel like I can become closer with Ifumi thanks to the star persona Fuki. I feel like my bronze with Ifumi will grow stronger soon. Nobody thinks you're alive at this point. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Are you gonna hang out with Ifumi? Yeah, hang out with her. Thank you. Thank you. Please take a seat. 
I quit the Ladies' I... Professional Shogi Players Association. I need to start over as an amateur. Um, you'll triumph in the end. That's my intention. There were a lot of people who covered for me by saying that I was just being used by adults, but I'm the one who was most at fault. I was overconfident. If only I had taken a look at myself and properly assessed my shogi skills, I believed that with my skills, I could overcome being treated like an idol. There's nothing I can say about my mother. You didn't abandon me. Even after you learned about the fixed matches, now I know how encouraging it feels to have someone believe in you. At first, this was just a deal. You help me develop new moves and I give you shogi lessons. But before I knew it, you became someone I couldn't do without. Oh good. I'm not gonna pay attention to all the criticism anymore. This time, I'll earn everyone's praise with my own skills. Great. I believe in you. The reason I'm able to think this way is because you stuck by my side. I'm really grateful. Well, I'm glad. Feel a strong bond with Ifumi. Hooray! This is I something I've wanted to get thou her art disability. I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the star, granting thee infinite power. Allows you to swap current party with backup members during anyone's turn. I love this because normally I can only swap characters with Angela's turn and not anyone else's, which is super annoying. But now I can swap with other characters and not just Angela's, which is All right. super, super useful. All right. You can now fuse Lucifer, the most powerful persona of the Star Arcana. Interesting. Well then, on to our final lesson. I truly that the no, Phantom well. Thieves find my lessons useful. Um. So you know, what do you mean? Um. So I'm just gonna be straight up. Yeah, we do. I feel honored to be told that from one of the Phantom Thieves. I spoke to you about my mother, and then my mother changed. I knew that couldn't be a coincidence. If there's anything I can do to help, please know that you can rely on me. All right. Thank you. I will support you in whatever you want to accomplish. Now let's play a match. I have a lot of new moves I'd like to test out. I hope you're okay to stay here a while longer. Sure. Thank you. From the bottom of my heart. Nice. Sweet. Excellent. Awesome. All right. The campaign season is really heating up. Did you already decide who you're voting for? I see Shido's as popular as ever. Is there any point in anyone else running? His approval rating went up again. How high will it go? Alright. You think Shido's gonna become the Prime Minister at this rate? With Akechi-kun and Shido-san, it feels like some heroes have been born this year. Well. That's Shall right. The turning point of Manian era is when a hero was born. They address everyone's fears and worries and skillfully carry out a revolution. Representative Shido is like that, don't you think? A hero? Hmm, don't make me laugh. This is getting really bad. We need to make everyone realize it. All right. Got a lot of people wanting to hang out with us today. Han is not ready to level up yet. Makoto and Haru. Haru levels up fast. All right. So this is the next person I want to focus on. I understand that this person's like ability is probably not as useful as some of the other characters, like some of my other confidants, because uh, I probably like realistically or. 
I guess what the strategically the best the next thing I should try to level up is like the my other party members because my party members I'm actually fighting with and just having those abilities leveled up is just gonna be super useful combative wise. However, I am like super, super invested and interested in what the heck's going on with EY's storyline. He just seems like there's something really interesting and like peculiar that's going on there. And plus, I, I mean, I have to be honest, I love EY as a character anyway. My sexy uncle and all that. So, um, not gonna, I'm going not, I'm gonna be completely like 100% honest and shameless about that. So, um, I think I'm gonna focus on trying to get EY. Um... So we'll see. Get a fortune reading. Please take a seat. What shall we do? What would you like to have? Affinity, affinity, affinity. Um, EY. Let's do Mon Monihisa EY. This reading will be 5,000 yen. Have fortune read. Hooray. Here we go. Here I go. Hmm. Nice. Your feelings should have reached the other person. Well, that's all for today. Hope it was helpful. What do you think? Hope you're happy with your fortune. I look forward to your next visit. Sweet. Um, meanwhile, we can level up. Han's not ready. I want to level up Okoto. We've been leveling up Haru a lot lately, and I want to kind of play catch up with Makoto because Makoto is Makoto is seven and Haru is eight. Let's get to Makoto. What are you doing today, Angelus Kun? I just finished up some student council work. I have some things to take care of, and I'll be in school's vicinity. Let me know if you need anything. Nobody thinks you're alive. Go right away. We're gonna go to the stadium? Yeah. Oh, Angel's Kun, have you decided our plans for today? Let's hang out. At a time like this? Yeah! Our bond is growing. Shall we go? Let's go to the Big Bang Burger. One of my favorite places, I guess. For a date. Something the matter? So what did you want to talk about? Well, um, I was wondering if you could maybe lend me some cash? What? <laughs> what? It's nothing real major, but I need to, like, right now. I'll pay you back, though, honest, please? Does this have to do with Tsukasa? Mm-hmm. He dropped a super expensive bottle of sake at work, so the club's making him pay for it, but he needs help. How suspicious. He's lying to you, Aiko. Don't give him any money. He's not lying. I know you're all weird about the fact that he's a host, but my Sukas is not like that. He's really gentle and honest, too. He even calls me princess. I'm the only one he says that to, you know. He says it's because I'm special. So he calls you his special princess. What do you think, Angelus Kun? Um, he says that to all his girls. Yes. I have to agree. Every girl who gives him money is his princess. That way he can never get their names mixed up. Oh, that's kind of smart. Don't accuse him of that. You don't have any proof. You're not wrong about <sighs> that. But did you ask anyone at his club about the broken bottle? Well, um, no. He told me not to talk to them about it, though. He's too proud to give, have me go crying to his boss. Please, Makoto, you're the only person I can trust. All my other friends would rather focus on cram school and entrance exams than take time to help me. And who knows what my parents say if I tried to ask them. Please, even a little. I think you should end your relationship with him. If you don't put a stop to this, he might try to drag you into some suspicious line of work. Oh, he already got me a job. It's nothing weird, though. I'm just serving drinks at a bar to help him pay off that broken bottle. He said I'll be number one in no time. Maybe I'll just keep doing it after I graduate high school, though. I mean, it's not like I'm gonna go to college. <laughs> Aiko! He can't just... You can't just do what he says. He's trying to deceive you. A smart person like you totally wouldn't understand what it's like. You're just gonna go to a good college, work at a fancy company, and then what? At the end of the day, your life's gonna be totally boring. I mean, is that seriously how you want to live? Boring is in the eyes of the beholder, honey. How? Way to be a ridiculously awful 
non-supportive friend. I... I'm not sure yet. But be it that as it may, you should still stay f as far away from him as you can. So you're not gonna help me? Ugh, just forget it. I can make it up if I just let some customers take me out on dates after work. <sighs> Aika, wait. I don't want to have to tell you this, but Tsukasa has been texting me almost constantly. Recently he's been asking if my sister and I live alone, and that he'd be glad to help us out. Even today he asked me if I'm still happy with my boyfriend. Listen to me, Aiko. He's not serious about you. Don't give me that. Tsukasa's just so nice that he'd worry about my friends for me. Wait, you were texting him behind my back? What the heck, Makoto? Did you not- or are you not hearing what you're saying? You're hearing what you want to hear. It was mostly him texting me. Ugh, you have the grades, the looks, a cool boyfriend, and you seriously still want more? Are you like... are You are not hearing... 90% of what's being said to you, Aiko. You are so blind and deaf at the same time. But you know what? I mean, uh, you're your own woman, and you know you gotta make your, your own decisions and your own mistakes, so this bed that you're making, just be ready to lie on it. Tsukasa is all I have. You can't take him away from me. Please listen. That's not what I'm trying to do. Yeah, right. Just keep your hands off. I'd never forgive you if you stole him away, Makoto. Oh my goodness, this girl. She is... <sighs> she's a piece of work. Tsukasa is all she has? You know, I think she's exactly the kind of girl who those gangs in Shinjuku are on the lookout for. Lonely, depressed girls who have nowhere to vent their frustrations. Actually... Aiko's family is quite well off. Her multi-talented younger brother seems to be the sole focus of her parents' attention, though. I'm sure that's why she fell for Tsukasa in the first place. He treats her like she's special. But asking a high schooler for money isn't normal boyfriend behavior. She needs to realize that. You're gonna help, right? Um, eh, she deserves him. No, I'll say absolutely. Thank you very much. I think thank you. It's reassuring to hear you say that. Aiko's blessed to have both money and a family, yet she's still trying to break free from them. She's almost the exact opposite of but... me. But I guess in a sense, watching her now is almost like looking back at my past self. I was so blinded by my own convictions that I never stopped to consider other alternative viewpoints in the world. But that's not the right way to live. I don't want to show her that. I want to show her that, just like you did for me. I can sense a deep bond of trust from Makoto. Hooray! Endure! Everyone's getting up All to right. level 8. I know she wants me to stay out of her business, but I'd never forgive myself if I let this come to pass. Hmm. Was it? What is the right way to live? At any rate, we're going to catch that horrible host. I'll let you know once I've thought of how to do it. I'll see you later. Thank you again for today. I'll see you later. Ah, you're back. The election battle has reached the halfway point. The polls for each election ward have remained the same, though. Does this mean Shido's victory is guaranteed? That would be the case. I wonder if voting will shift if Shido has a change of heart. Nobody vo will vote for him once they find out he's a criminal. Assuming they find out before they vote. That's the important part. We would prefer him to announce his crimes before the election. But if the change of heart doesn't make it, the election will just go as expected. Um, results aren't what matters. You are correct. So long as his true nature is brought to light, other options will be available to us. All we can do is change his heart. We should put it be we should be able to put a stop to this if we succeed. Alright. I'm not sure who wants to hang out with me. Sojiro, Shihaya, oh yeah, I think I'm gonna hang out with Sojiro. But we'll do that in the next episode. Woo! My throat's getting dry. Ugh. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, love yourselves and love each other.